I've done my first cook here. It's still cooking on the GE Profile Indoor Smoker, which was formerly known as Arden when they did the Indiegogo crowdfunding. And so far it seems to be going good. The only issue is that my house, I have this vent going too, really, really seems to have a strong fire pit smoke smell. Like you could definitely smell the burning wood, the pellets, which I thought because of this technology, I understand, sure, the carbon monoxide isn't coming through, which is what makes it safe for indoors, but I thought it would maybe vent out a little bit of the smoke smell somehow, similar to like a air purifier or fume filtration that you use for a laser cutter. But no, you smell the smoke pretty strong. It makes your house smell like a fire pit. So I'm not too ecstatic about that. And so far that's the only problem I have with this unit. I haven't tried the food yet. So you can see it's definitely a bit smoky in there. Has a bit to go. I'm doing a turkey breast. The butterball boneless, it was already thawed completely. I'm trying to get to 165. It's been cooking. It would be nice if it tells you how long it's been cooking, but it doesn't. But it's been cooking for about an hour, I would say only. So it's gone up pretty quickly. It's already at 109 degrees Fahrenheit. Target is 165, and apparently it's supposed to shut off and turn to keep warm by the time it gets to 165, so we'll see what happens there. I know that the first cook on a lot of appliances has a weird smell. I have the Ninja Foodi there when I first cooked with that. I have the Black & Decker toast oven when I first cooked with that. Both of them had that smell of burning off, you know, just in general, the um, any lacquer that was inside, just the first cook always has a weird smell. So I'm hoping maybe the next time I use it, it's not gonna have as much of a smoke smell because it could be the smoke mixed with you know whatever burning off inside so I'll give that benefit of the doubt but for now if it were to stay like this all the time I don't think I would use it very often especially not if I was gonna have company over that day because it really is very strong and although once again I love the smell of smoke I love the smell of smoked food I actually have many fireside candles I just am not a fan of the smell of smoke inside of my house when I'm using a smoker because typically you're supposed to use a smoker outside because of carbon monoxide and this is supposed to be safe to use inside. So I still feel fine. It's been on for an hour. I don't think it's unsafe, but it doesn't give me a good feeling to smell this smoky inside of my house. And that's my update for now. Also, I did just post another video I went through the manual before I set it up and one of the questions I had was does it need its own circuit because it is a large appliance well it's a small appliance but it's larger than other appliances and um, basically what is the wattage and it, I was surprised to see that they don't actually mention what the wattage is anywhere except for on the unit itself so on the unit itself in the back it does say that it's 1400 watts 120 volts so that was safe I knew for this circuit because I run my Ninja on it and shockingly enough the Ninja actually takes a lot more than this does. The Ninja is 1750 and my Rig coffee machine actually takes 1450 more than this is. Only at startup but still. So as long as you don't have anything else plugged in to the same outlet then you should be good to go and obviously with anything the first few cooks especially, I wouldn't leave the house while it's cooking. I'm very close to it, so I just want to make sure everything's going good so far, so good. The side of it feels a little warm. I can definitely feel the heat coming off the front. Make sure there's nothing in front of here because it does have an exhaust. The side's a little hotter. Top is hot, which it does say on here, hot surface. There's a sticker that comes on it before and check the pellets. It didn't use a lot of pellets so far. It's really doing like a light type of smoke, but it smells very smoky, so I know the smoke's getting in there. I did have it set at smoke level five, but I turned it down to four because the smoke smell in my house was so strong, and this seems to have helped maybe a little bit, but 
hopefully the food is getting smoky enough and it's not all coming out here. So typically I like GE appliances and you know my oven is a GE, my refrigerator is a GE, my microwave is a GE. Um, yeah, so I'm sure the product is good. I just wish it didn't have the smoke smell, but I guess that's what you get for indoor smoking, right?